victory over Antonio Yo Conte's Chelsea was exactly what the doctor ordered at Manchester United. The Red Devils haven't been able to decide whether they are in good form or poor form over the winter months as Jose Mourinho bagged a brilliant 2 1 over his old club. It was a plucky performance at Old Trafford, coming back from a goal down after William broke the deadlock. Romelu Lukaku stuck two fingers up to the critics with the equalising goal before Jesse Lingard extended his purple patch with the winner. The impressive performance came in a week where David of G attracted remarkable praise for his midweek showing at Sevilla. It seems nobody is in doubt that the Spaniard is the world's best goalkeeper. Everybody at Old Trafford is duly waxing lyrical about their number one and club legend Gary Neville takes no shame in running with the trend. Nevertheless, he did apply a sobering twist to the form of the G by claiming that he is the club's only world class player in spite of the January arrival of Alexis Sanchez. The Chilean moved to United under great publicity and controversy and with blockbuster wages, but has struggled to set the world alight in his first seven appearances. De G's the only world-class player Manchester United have got. Wyo you could maybe say Sanchez, but not at Manchester United yet, even if he has been at a level for the last five or six years that you would say is world-class, Neville told Goal. But of G's the only player Manchester United have got at this moment in time that I would say has performed for the club at a world-class level. The other player I would say that has done brilliantly well, whether you could say he's world-class or not, is Antonio Valencia over the last two or three years. He's been outstanding. But to me Dev G is their standout player in terms of world standard at the club without a shadow of a doubt. You've got to say, he's pretty spot on. The closest candidate is the aforementioned Sanchez. Yet, no matter how early into his United career it is, he'd struggle to say he's been world class as at Old Trafford so far. And the confusion his arrival has caused for the futures and roles of Marcus Rashford and Anthony Marshall will have fans hoping he hits his Arsenal heights once again. They have that spark of magic between the sticks, but need that extra sparkle of world class up top. Do you think DG is Man United's only world class player? Have your say in the comments section below.